So while they talk about Petraeus and the way he portrays us, all I could say is look at the media and the way it portrays us. How that phenomenon's got so many layers, how the way I look when the camera's on affects the way that they grade us. I remember high school vividly. And I remember people that I saw that I knew were brilliant. And they were, you know, like my homie on the corner that would memorize a rap album in a, a day. The steppers who would like memorize these complex patterns and just be brilliant. And as much as I remember that brilliance, I remember the further on I went in my, in my educational career, those expressions of brilliance were just not as common. I was in a specialized high school, but it was a public high school. So I had to pass a test to get into the school. But I looked around and I didn't see me. I didn't feel like me was present there. I feel like I took this test to get in here and perhaps it was luck or whatever else it was because no one told me after I passed the test that who I was was brilliant enough to be successful in that space. Teachers didn't tell me I was brilliant, but when I rhymed on a lunchroom table and I could command an audience of about 50 or 75 young people and they could be like, yo, the metaphors is crazy, I felt affirmed. Human beings have a tendency to revolve around spaces and places and people that make them feel like they're brilliant. And if it happens in a school and in a classroom or around a subject area, that becomes your thing. And if it happens around hip hop or happens around a gang, wherever it is that, that, that the endorphins start firing and the actualization starts happening, you go right back to that space. And so it is actually much more important there to be able to showcase the diverse expressions of black and brownness. So you wanna be able to say, see different versions of black excellence. And black excellence may be artistic, but it can also be scientific. It could also be artistic. It could also be pedagogical. And so my work in education really has been to be able to allow folks who were on the corners rapping to feel like they could be an anthrobiochemist as well. And it's not in a way of like, you know, let me pull you up from where you are so you can become a scientist like I'm then, um, but more of a, I know you're dope and I know you're brilliant, and I would love for you to be able to understand how dope and brilliant you are.